In this video, we'll be demonstrating the MyWay I-201 digital scale. This scale has a weighing capacity of 200 grams in increments in 0.01 gram divisions, which is equivalent to 10 milligram divisions. Um, the scale is powered up. It reads 00, zero in the scale comes standard with a 200 gram calibration weight. So we'll put this weight on the balance to see if it needs to be calibrated. And when we place the 200 grams on, it reads E, 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 which is basically overload. And the scale isn't overloaded. Um, it just needs to be calibrated because right now the scale is reading the 200 gram weight as something greater than 200 grams because if I put on a 50 gram mass we'll see the scale reads 50.03 put on another 50 grams and we're at 100.08 so it's off by eight divisions so calibration is really simple although the manual tells you uh, really the scale needs to be calibrated the scale should always be calibrated when it's first put into use. So to perform a calibration, we want to shut off the balance. We'll be pressing the zero key down, churning the on key, and releasing both. The scale shows a random number off the A to D converter. And this number means nothing at all to you, but this is just the value of the A to D converter at zero state when nothing is on the platform. Press the unit key once, and you'll notice this display will say 00, zero save, so it stores that value of nothing on the platform or the zero state. And now we need to put the 200 gram calibration weight on the center of the platform. And once again, we'll press the unit key, and you'll notice it will say 00, zero save, and then there'll be another value. And this is the value of the A to D converter at full capacity. Now, you'd want to remove the calibration weight, shut off the scale, turn the scale back on. The scale will go through its power-up sequence, return it to 0, 0.00. If we place our 200 gram weight on the balance, you'll see the scale is now calibrated. Before we get an EEE because it was in excess of the 200 grams, now the scale has been calibrated. It's 199.99. The scale increments in 0 0.01 gram, so it's on the money. If I put on my 50 gram weights that I had before, these are reading 50.03. You'll see now 49.99. I'll throw on another 50 gram weight. We're at 99.99. So the scale's been calibrated. We could let the scale run a little bit longer and perform another calibration, and we'll probably get it right on its money at 100. And with a calibration mass 200, it would read 200 right on the dot. Now let's go over some of the other features that the I-201 balance offers. So it comes with this plastic draft shield. You have three doors. You have a top door, two side doors, and you can use this if you'd like. A lot of people don't bother running it with the balance. Uh, it's plastic. Uh, you know, it's, it's something nice. A lot of competitive brands don't have this draft shield. Uh, it comes with it. It's plastic. It does the job. If you want to use it, use it. If not, uh, we'll show you the balance without it. So, uh, once again, I have like a 20 gram weight. Put it on the platform. It's off. Fifty grams, so that weight's probably off. These are low-cost brass weights, but the hundred is there. Okay, let's throw the two hundred gram weight back on, and you'll notice we can change the weigh modes here on the bottom. We're in grams. If I press the unit key once, we'll be in ounces. Press the unit key again, we'll be in milligrams. So this is milligrams. Then we have troy ounces, penny weight, carrots, grains, pots count, and then we're back to grams. 
You'll notice on the side here, this is a weigh guide giving you some idea of the weighing capacity being used of the balance. So if I throw on 50 grams, you'll notice the weigh guide really doesn't even increment. Throw on another 50 grams, you'll notice the weigh guide move up. So that's a nice little feature that the MyWay i201 balance offers. Um, the scale does come with the AC adapter, which is a nice feature. And I have another scale here just to show you. You have a sprint bubble indicator for easy leveling. And on the rear of the scale, you have four adjustable feet. This is really nice. Uh, most scales in this pricing category don't have any adjustable feet or they might have adjustable feet just on the front. The scale can also be operated off of SITS AA batteries. So you can just put those right in the rear of the scale um, and the scale would off operate off of batteries. The rear of the scale is where the AC adapter is plugged in. Um, you have a stainless steel platform that's removable for easy cleaning. And basically that's it for the MyWay i201. It's an extremely popular scale for schools that are looking for an affordable 0.01 gram scale. Uh, we have these always in stock at balances.com or you can visit our new website which is scaleman.com. We've been offering the MyWay line for at least 10 years, and it's extremely popular again because of the price point. We hope this video helped you in your buying decision, and if you have any questions, you can give us a call again or visit our website at balances.com.